I don't know if you can justify or how you justify forcing my constituents to pay for EVs and EV infrastructure for coastal elites and wealthy people, but somehow you do. Well, I need to point out that wealthy people were specifically excluded from the Inflation Reduction Act. Well, we I just we gave you the number. I, do you dispute that two-thirds of EV owners are owned by people over 100, 000, that make over 100,000? Did you sure, dispute the, that? Yeah, the first EVs, of course, were Do you dispute that? Uh, no, mean, but that number's it, going down. Those are the facts. It doesn't matter if they're going down now. My, why were you the against folks that I represent can't afford them today, sir. Why were you against cutting their costs? All these factors. I'm not against cutting their costs. The market should do it. But you want the, the government, you want my taxpayers to pay to cut the cost, which isn't cutting the if cost. You were of it's the view, subsidizing the cost. Congressman, Sir, if you were with of all the view, these factors no combined, subsidy to propulsion all these vehicles, factors you combined oil and gas mean, that, mean that for you every that oil EV and gas sold, subsidy sir, at a loss, that the cost of the, as my, as my colleague on the other side, the gas guzzling pickup truck is higher now to pay for the loss as you kill. Your administration, and you in particular, kill the auto industry. And I'll remind you, in 2008, after a financial crisis, the federal government bailed out this industry. So while you're here today, will you commit and will you pledge to oppose any effort to bail out the auto industry after you force it into bankruptcy again? Will you do that today, sir? Congressman, I got started in politics when I guess the, answer is the no. I yield factory the was at risk of being shut down because an elected official in my state tried to block the administration from saving Chrysler. I got involved and stood with the UAW to save those jobs, and I'll always be with auto jobs being preserved.